Hello, this is Don and I am not a mechanic, but I'm going to attempt to change my valve gasket, valve cover gasket, I think that's what they call it, alright, off the battery, this battery is pretty dead, I haven't drove this car in a while, so it's probably safer for me than most of you that's gonna probably watch this video. We're gonna be taking off electrical components like uh, these connectors. We wanna just be 100% safe that we are not gonna damage anything, you know? Get it? All right, let's move. Now that we get that off, um, this actually, uh, most cars is a 10 socket if you don't really familiar. Mm. You need a 10 socket, all of these are 10. And it actually says it on the top. If you look on some of, uh, maybe it's on your car, but it's a 10. Just make sure you have the right um, tool because you don't want to round these up. That would be a worse nightmare, okay? This is the front um, gasket. Um, I'm gonna attempt to get to the back gasket because that's where I think my leak is but I'm also gonna change the front now guys you have to be very careful when you're putting these back on to not over tighten them because look how easy it is to come off I'm not even gonna apply full force you see that it opens pretty easy so when you're putting it back the same thing is expected and not over tightening guys I'm done taking off all the screws and bolts on the top um, what you have to do you have to disconnect uh, this so once you disconnect this and you get all the screws this is the first step you get all those out it should come up easy like that here we go uh, it's not all that bad on this part looks pretty decent so after you get the first uh, top piece off you want to get a 12 millimeter and this is one uh, let me see uh, one two three four five six uh, i think this one needs to come off too yep so one two three four five six so this one will make seven and you have eight, nine. If I'm counting them right, I'll let you guys know in the process. And I'm just doing this for the first time, so yeah, man. Okay, guys, you're gonna need to take off your front if you got any front um, covers in your car. You need to get a flathead, flathead screwdriver. Kind of, you see, there's a groove right here where the screwdriver can fit. And this is how slim my screwdriver is. Right? You kind of want to get under there and bring that up. Now, guys, if your front cover is attached to your grill. I think I'm gonna have to use both ends to get it. Hold on. So as we can see, there are pins that clip down into your grill. I attempt to uh, take some of the O's off. I just use uh, pliers, just move it like a little bit to and fro. Not too much to break it, just a little bit. So guys, you're gonna need to move this rail right here. Uh, this is 210, 